Yo, my name is Lawrence Levin. I'm really glad to be here tonight. And can I have three three people maybe come up from the audience? Maybe somebody from this side. Three people. Come on, come on down. Give them a nice round of applause. Come on, come on, come on. Come on down. Come on down. Come on down. They have a choice of any one of these numbers. What I'm going to do is offer it to you. You guys can choose together whatever number you like. Put it in the box. Let's say you pick number four. Put it in the box so four is up. That will confirm your choice. Put the lid on, and I will have to tell just by looking into her face what number was chosen. Go ahead, give it a try. And you'll go and just, oh, okay. Just find a number while I dance. <laughs> What's your name? Jacob. Okay, Jacob. Looking at you, oh, that was perfect. Thank you for all that mouth action right there. <laughs> no, really, that, that just gave it away right there. Because what I watched him do, what I watched him do is that both sides went perfectly uh, up on both sides, so that means you picked an even number, and then he shot tongue right through there twice. So I'm going to say you picked two. Open it up and let me see. Oh! <laughs> Let me know when you're ready. <laughs> now, you must look at him. Does this look like a man who's being meek? Who's being... No, no, you look like an alpha male right now. <laughs> you're an alpha male. And look at that face! <laughs> God looks like he sucked the lemon! <laughs> okay, so between alpha male and Mr. Lemon Sucker... I would say that we would have to have picked an intense number, an intense strong number. What's the most intense strong number on the dice? Six. Six. He got it right over here. I'm going to say pick a six. It's a six. Ever since I was a kid, I used to watch these TV shows on Saturday night, you know? There'd be this uh, psychic guy, right? This hand would hold the envelope up to his head, but the other hand would be down here scratching his butt. <laughs> Your psychic gland isn't up here. <laughs> it's in your butt. <coughs> hey, I can prove it to you. Watch this. Definitely, definitely, I'm gonna prove it. Uh, is there anybody out here in the audience it kind of woke up this morning, you know, doesn't feel very psychic at all. Just kind of woke up and said, oh, wow, I just feel dumb as a stump today. What I'd like you to do is just warm up a little bit. It goes like this. Oh, God. Go ahead, warm it up, warm it up. I'm going to put this card. Don't know what it is, do you? No. I'm going to put it right down there on the seat. Now, Josh. Take your psychic uh, gland yeah. and sit right down. <laughs> Open up. <laughs> Feel the information rise. <laughs> Looking good, baby. I think he's got it. Take the cards in your hand. Take a look at them all. Bunch of different cards, no? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Now what I'd like you to do, go ahead, turn them over, and oh, cut them approximately in half, and put one half in each open palm, just like that. Very good. And because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up this bag, I'm going to stand behind you. Whichever hand you choose, throw it right over your shoulder. Okay. Go ahead, anytime today. <laughs> what a shot. Okay, that was good, that was good, that was good. Okay. <laughs> Well, I'm picking up your mess. <laughs> Please, uh, just go ahead and divide the rest of the cards approximately in half. Put one in each palm. And now, Josh, you have another choice. Whichever hand you want, throw it over your shoulder. <laughs> That was cool, didn't it? <laughs> this is my show. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, let's see what cards you got left. He's only got a few cards left, so what I'm going to do is ask you, go ahead, touch any card you want, 
Oh, good choice. Let's bring that car to the top. Good for now, you, good for you. We'll see. Okay. <laughs> Who's this guy? <laughs> okay, what I'd like you to do is just open up your right palm. And I will take the card that Josh chose and lay it right there in his palm. What's the card you're holding in your hand? Queen of Clubs. Took him a while. Let's see if that Queen. gland, oh, I hope so, was correct or not. Will you stand up and take a look at the card you're sitting on and show it to everybody as well? Oh! Oh! Unbelievable! You are good! High five, dude! High five! All right! Thank you! Thank you! time you're watching the corpse grinders uh, one of the things we promised you in 2010 was to give you more magic and I got my good friend here Lawrence Lemons who does psychic magic where's Brittany Brittany would you come around here Brittany what I'd like you to do is take this felt tip pen I put a briefcase way over here on the other side of the stage and I put a pad of paper in there so it couldn't be seen so what I'd like you to do is print the name across that paper of anyone you've ever known in your life it can even be a pet okay I I'm going to pick a number. You pick a number, turn around, don't show me Close what your number you've chosen. And I'm going to ask you, write a number in the crystal ball between, say, oh, 1 and 100. Okay? You go ahead and do that. And you... Okay. There's something, I hate to admit it, but odd about your face this time. Because you're so childlike right now. A child's number odd on the dice would have to be a 3. Damn! Oh, Why don't you change the dice one more time? You have probably written a number that indicates a time in your life that was, that was important to you. Important. And so I would say something happened to you as a teenager that probably was a transition. And when you're in the spotlight like this, I would say you wrote a 14. Open it up. Let's see. Wow. Or yes. yep. And I would say the number you chose this time, you went from child to alpha male <laughs> in, in a big shot. So I would say you picked the only number an alpha male would pick on the dice would be six. Jeez. And the name, the wow. name that Brittany go wrote the over there in go the briefcase. Where are you, Brittany? Go get it, Brittany. Touch my hand for a moment. I would love for you to go over there, but I want you over here. <laughs> Something, uh, something, ooh, making fun of, making fun of, a name that's making fun of. Um, I, smart Alec, um, smart Alec. Sassy? That's what my dog said. <laughs> yeah, he got it. Are you serious? Yes! So you do this insane stuff to other people. My name is Lawrence Lemon, and I come up on a lot of websites. There you go. Or you can call me at area get code. Get your pen. All right, get it He all already out. knows who's going to call him. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'll be expecting your call at 415-383-3717. One more time, real quick. 383-3717. That was absolutely fun. Thank you. That's it for Lawrence. Yeah.